Breaking news. Dino Maeye in distress loses PDP Kogi West ticket. Sends strong message to Terju Yusuf. Hello, my wonderful people. It is really happening. Dino Maleye, you know, has become uh, a laughing stock. In fact, they made video of him and then uh, much more going on. Dino has become, you know, this is what he does to people. And right now, he said there was a serious gang up against him. Uh, you know, he said this is not uh, what happened. There is a serious gang up against him. Uh, some people want, you know, that there's a gang up. And this is what uh, Dino is, you know, this is what he's, um, he's working at. He said there's a gang up. It was unimaginable how much people, the length people could go to be able to get, you know, to get to this, that, you know, Dino is working, you know, he said he, they know that he can win. And so they are doing everything, humanly speaking, possible to ensure that, you know, he does not uh, win. And this is why they worked at him, worked against him. Well, my wonderful people, Dino Malaya, you can begin to see that um, he, he feels very, he feels very hurt at some of the things that are going on. Uh, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like or share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Dino Maileye loses PDP Kogi West senatorial seat. Send strong message to Terju Yusuf. Senator Dino Maileye on Tuesday, May the 24th, lose the PDP ticket for Kogi West senatorial district primaries. The former lawmaker lost the ticket to a current member of the House of Representatives, Terju Yusuf. Maleye attributed his loss is losing the party primaries to an unimaginable gang up against him and his political career. A former lawmaker who represented Kogi West Senatorial District at the 8th National Assembly, Dino Maleye, has lost the People Democratic Party to Terju Yusuf. Maleye, in a rerun of the People Democratic Party primaries on Tuesday, Hold 99 votes, while Yusuf, a lawmaker, and the House of Representatives called 163 votes. Dino reports that there is a serious gang up against him, everyone and everything working against him to ensure that he does not make this very desired position because they know the impact he will make on politics and the people. Reports that while speaking after the primary election, Yusuf, who represented Kabi Buna Ijomu, Federal constituency describe his victory as the will of God. Dino has kept on nursing his loss. Reacting to the outcome of the position of the party primaries, Malaya in a tweet on Tuesday, May the 24th, congratulated Yusuf on scaling and winning the People Democratic Party ticket for Kogi West Senatorial District, while stating that the gang up against him was unimaginable. Malaya appreciated those who voted for him, he said. The primaries has been fought and won. I congratulate Honorable T.J. Yusuf and thank all who voted for me first and, in first and second ballots for me. Thank you all. The gang up was unimaginable. So this is our very own brother, Dino's position. He feels that he was seriously ganged up against. Uh, he feels that some people worked against him. They did everything, humanly speaking, possible to ensure that he does not uh, get that very desired position. And then um, he feels that, you know, this person, some people are part and parcel of some of the people who have worked against him and ensures that, you know, he does not, you know, get that very desired position. Dino said he's going to get it back. Okay, he's going to get it back. He's going to get it back. That no matter what happens, he's going to, you know, he's going to get that position. So there is something seriously not right. Something is definitely off and something is not uh, adding up, if you ask me. You know, you know, this is, there is something really not right. So my wonderful people, we continue to, you know, speak out and, you know, talk on, you know, some of the things that we need to work at to ensure that at the end of the day, we become a better people and we do not allow, okay, some of these people and what, what have you to destroy the very foundation of our, you know, our, our leadership and our, our society. Today, Nigeria is that country where a lot of persons and people who you should look at and, you know,
believe that are doing something worthwhile for the nation are becoming the very fabric and the people who are destroying the very nation. Dino Malaya was once a senator. What did he do? Okay, those hundred people that voted for him or 99, what did he do that they could look at and say, wow, this man has done something well. We all have to stand by him. I keep repeating that again and again, that every time you're given an opportunity to serve, serve well with integrity, honor, give all you can. So at the end of the day, okay, you are that best person. When you need to come back for any position, you will not need to vote and you will not need to campaign. The people will be the ones. The people will be the ones going out for you, campaigning for you, speaking for you and saying, no, we want this person in our district, as our governor, as our president. We want this person over and over and over again. Okay, we want this person. So that's what you should be. You don't, you, you know, you have opportunity to serve and you do nothing about it. You have opportunity to serve and you say nothing. You, 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 you're there, you're squandering the money. You are not helping. You're doing nothing, absolutely nothing. You know, so these are some of the real reasons why everybody must put hands down and work and ensure that we give our best. Because at the end of the day, every one of us will be the ones, you know, living, you know, living for it or paying the price for it. If we do nothing about it to ensure that we are free. You know, Dino has served before. What did he do for the sanitarian district? What did he do? Okay, what did he do? What did he do? How did he go about? What did he do? What did he do? What did he, you know, these are real, you know, situations happening and, you know, you know, these are real things happening. If somebody has been a governor. He wants to become Nigerian's president. What did he do? Somebody has been a senator. He wants to be, what did he do? Why do we have to? you know, support such an individual. What do we do? There is something you can do that when you say you are coming back, then everybody will stand with and for you. There's the truth on what is going on and why we must stand up against every form of oppressions and things going on. So at the end of the day, we are better people. We must stand up against every form and everything that is against us moving forward. We can't keep electing the same people who have no iota of truth tied to their belt. We can't keep walking like that. Leave us a comment. We'd love to hear from you. Please don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. Click on the notification button so you can get all our latest news. God bless. Have a fantastic day. Bye for now.